Welcome Snack Tackers, my name is Jason and I have another potentially fantastic product to review for you guys today. But first I want to remind you to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell, all the fun YouTube stuff. Now let's get to talking about this product. Well, okay, I should have done a little more research before I started this video. I didn't and I said I was going to to myself, but then I just, I literally just didn't. Because I don't know if I've had this before. I'll get it out and then let's get to talking about it. This is the new Sour Patch Cherry flavor, new limited edition. That's right, Sour Patch Cherry flavor. Now, here's the thing that I'm not sure of. The Cherry Sour Patch flavor was available internationally. I believe it was in Canada for a while. This is the first time it's in the States, but is it the first time it's in the States as a standalone flavor or the first time we've ever even had the possibility of a cherry? Because I feel like I've had Sour Patch Cherry. Was it maybe in the Sour Patch Fruit Salad? Was it maybe in one of the other Sour Patch Mixed Berries? Like, it feels like I've had Sour Patch Cherry, but I'm also not sure. And not one to pass up the opportunity to have more Sour Patch in my life because you know I love me some sour candy. I decided I'd review it anyway. These sorts of things happen, and um, we're just going to treat it like it's a new product. Entirely, totally new. This was purchased at a 7-Eleven for $2.99. Now, this is a Sour Patch, Sour Patch flavor. Why do I put the emphasis on the sour, because they've been doing the not so sour with a lot of the new fruits, the peach and the grape. This is not that. This is Sour Patch Kids Cherry. So, I mean, I'm excited. I love cherry. Sort of. I sometimes love cherry. Yeah, see? The smell and look of this is very familiar. But I've spent a lot of time in Canada where these were available. It's a high likelihood that I've had this in Canada at the very least. It smells like cherry. That's, I mean, that's all. <laughs> Let's give it a try. Three, two, one, snack tack. It's not bad. It's got a little bit of that cough medicine cherry quality to it, which isn't great. I'm going to do a handful. Well, three. Three is like a handful. It is sour. And higher quantities, way better. Better flavor balance to the sour and the cherry like medicine-y. Also a better amount of the texture. It kind of amalgamates together into one big gummy when you have more than one at a time. It's pretty good. I kind of enjoy it. Do I enjoy it more than base Sour Patch? No. Do I enjoy it more than watermelon flavor? No. Do I enjoy it more than some of the other Sour Patch flavors? No. But I still enjoy it. I still like it. It's still a Snack Tech Yas. That being said, I'm only gonna give it a 6 out of 10. I feel like base Sour Patch are an 8 out of 10. And really, really good flavors that we've had over the years fluctuate from there. This is a 6 out of 10, it feels like to me, and so it shall be. I also feel like I definitely have had this before. Now, I don't know if I've had it in Canada. I don't know if this was a part of, say, the fruit salad Sour Patch, or... Like I said, they had a mixed berry. They had to have had cherry, maybe it wasn't in cherry shape? Producer, do you... Do you Per chance, no. You continue to be as useless as ever. But the question we ask around here is not, have you had this before? You, the viewer, you, the proverbial, or you, the, the royal you. No. It's would you, me, you, buy it again? No. It's not bad, and I don't regret having it. But it's, like, not better than the base flavor. And if it's not better than the base flavor, why would you buy it over the base flavor? Sorry. But remember to check Instagram, TikTok, all the fun social media stuff. And I'll see you in the next one.